Hi, my name is Mapa Sampa, and I'm a graphic designer and visual artist. I've worked on many graphic designs and digital projects, such as advertising, mobile apps, brand identity, digital visualization, and digital concept. For me, the best program for these kinds of stuff is Adobe Illustrator. It's the most used vectorial program, allowing you to create graphics and illustrations for any media. Whether for the print or digital world, Illustrator allows us to create all kinds of graphic vectors, such as illustrations, logo, lettering, and icons, even three-dimensional graphic design. And what I like most about Illustrator is that Illustrator is in the Adobe ecosystem, where all Adobe digital products are integrated, so that it spoils creators in creating their great works in one place without having to move to another platform. Understanding Illustrator is essential for a graphic designer, illustrator, and digital artist. This course aims for you to be able to use Adobe Illustrator easily and quickly, even if you are a beginner with no previous experience in using Adobe Illustrator. This course is divided into seven episodes, as a first step that will help you understand Illustrator more easily and quickly. In the first episode, I will help you to understand the Illustrator interface, as a first step that will make it easier for you to understand Illustrator. Then in the second episode, we will create your first document and see the basic concept of the document. Next, I will show you what the basic and free shapes are, how to create and manipulate shapes using selection and direct selection tools, and other tools that have special functions for manipulating objects. After that, we will give color to the shape that we have created, such as giving stroke and fill, as well as how to create a gradient color which is one of the best parts of Illustrator. In the fifth episode, I will give you essential practices, that you must know when working with Illustrator, proceed to the next level where we will create a simple digital project as a summary of the previous episodes. And in the last episode, which is finishing and exporting the document to bring our work into reality. No previous experience is needed, I'll start from the basics. A guide to Illustrator is for illustrators, designers, or whoever wants to learn the most powerful vectorial tool namely Adobe Illustrator.